There we go. Sorry for the mishap. Sorry for the mishap. This is going to be part two of the podcast. Uh, that part one we ended kind of abruptly. But yeah, we were talking about that edge. We were talking about that edge and... Uh, edge, Hardy Boy. No, we were, uh, we were talking about Edge McFoley versus Terry Funk and Tom Jamer. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we were talking about that. We were talking about tag teams. Yeah, we were talking about tag teams. Boom, and that was a good tag team match. Uh, by the way, if you don't know this, Lita and Beulah Miguel Cuddy are in the match as well. But uh, I still count them as a two-man tag team because the four guys do most of the work. Uh, Lita and Beulah, they do a beautiful job in the match. They play their part very well as the valets or the women or the divas or whatever you want to call them. I want to call them women because we divas, that, yeah, because yeah. divas is, is uh, chauvinistic. That's my opinion. The butterfly belt is chauvinistic. I'm glad we got a belt. I wish it didn't look like a fucking billboard for WWE, but I do love the belts. So, hate butterfly. But anyway, yeah. Talking about tag team matches. Richard hit us with another good tag team match, and I'm going to hit you with a dude. I was done my cigarette out. Okay. Well, <laughs> But like another good tag team match would have to be Wow. I don't remember seeing a match called <laughs> It'd be interesting. <laughs> what is the tag team match? <laughs> but tag team match. Uh, uh you go. <laughs> okay. I can't think. Vicious Victor put a uh, put a good match on there. Uh, it's it was the Steiner Brothers versus Legion of Doom, and uh, that's a good match. And they had a couple good matches together, but that was a good match. And ah, uh, oh, shit. Oh, okay. Thank you, WWW, again because I forgot the name of the move that LOD did that I talked about yesterday, and I just remembered again. It's called the Doomsday Device. Remember Richard? We yeah. were trying to figure yeah. Doomsday device, that 